The new coronavirus is infecting and killing more people each day. It's been just a few weeks since the virus first broke out in Wuhan, but now the number of people who have coronavirus in China has outnumbered those who had SARS. Our Che Chong Yun has the latest. The new type of coronavirus that first appeared in the Chinese city of Wuhan late last month continues to claim more victims. As of Thursday, the death toll in China tops 170, and the total number of confirmed cases comes to around 8,000, with an infection rate much faster than the SARS outbreak in 2003, which had around 5,300 confirmed cases. As the virus continues to spread, China's President Xi said that preventing and containing it remains a grim and complex task. China state-run media CCTV reported on Wednesday that Xi has sent a military medical team to the front line to prevent the epidemic from spreading. Emphasizing the role of the military, Xi requested army hospitals to cure patients and science institutes to actively tackle the virus. In order to prevent the virus from spreading, the city of Wuhan has increased its Lunar New Year holiday to two weeks. The holiday was originally supposed to end on January 30th, but will now end on February 13th. Companies in the region will delay their reopening. The China CDC said the extension will reduce human-to-human -human contact, which is a critical way of tackling respiratory infections. China's central government has already extended the holiday four days, and other provinces are also delaying the reopening of businesses and schools. The International Ski Federation has also called off ski World Cup races that were due to take place near Beijing in order to protect the health of the participants. Che Jong-yun, Arirang News.